if you're a collector and if you can get your hands on opus 11 12 13 and 14 cards uh, sealed and full art singles the reason for this is because 11 11 through 14 came out during the the zombie apocalypse the COVID pandemic and um and so square enix pulled back a lot and those runs were very short printed and i think what we're going to see in due time especially if as long as the game keeps holding is that there will be a greater increase of value for these sets and it's already happening i mean look right there on tcg player booster box so a booster box at retail roughly you're going to be paying about 80 dollars now one box is about 375 look at that 400 dollars yeah yeah this is moving um, up of between 11 12 13 14 your most collectible is going to be 11 and then 14 and then i would say 12 and then 13. and these all are just continuously rising in price so that's what you want to try and get if you can find somebody that has them if you can get them somewhere at a good deal grab them i certainly am doing my best to get them because wave one opus one is so difficult right now to get and people are holding them and there's not much out there if you can get 11 12 13 14 i would say definitely try to do it and looking through those sets you just mentioned like there's no supply on tcg yeah. player and the market history is all just to the moon this common full art card was like five six bucks but yeah people started to realize like, oh my gosh, this set was short printed. Like, yeah, there's no grab supply. Everything. Yeah, yeah, grab it, like right? of these cards. Yeah, and so, and this is where, this is where it will maintain for the collector no matter what. So if you got a reprint of this, it's not gonna kill the original. It won't, it, it, it shouldn't, right? And people freak out thinking that it's going to, but no, that one will always be unique. I can tell uh, you as a collector, year. you always want the originals, right? You always want the original. Yeah. And then you got Tifa here, which is the most, I would say this is probably the second most sought after card currently. Uh, it used to be the first one. I call it second because Yuffie's signature, I would say is the most now. You know, the only listing of this on TCG player is in Spanish, right? Mm -hmm. And then the next one up is your 9.5, which is $5,000. And it's just like, if these cards are selling for five hundred seven hundred dollars like for me it's like someone out there who has the stack of them they're gonna start yeah. hitting the market right and then oh yeah so yeah. where are they you know i know and i know like rudy from alpha investments says that kind of thing a lot he, he'll say yeah. something like you know i like his channel and stuff but sometimes he'll say something like i can go to tcg player right now and i can't even find 12 boxes and i'm like you know game stores have like a lot of boxes probably in yeah. their back and if they saw people that's because it's the price is in the is in the dumps and if people saw that they were going to the moon you're going to start seeing those get listed so for me it's actually you need an extra variable in that equation is and that is mm -hmm. oh the prices are high but you're not seeing new supply come to the market but uh, again 11 through 14 were intentionally short printed because of, the, of covid and you know the company wasn't sure what was going to happen right like all tcgs at that point were just given a huge halt we're seeing maybe some graded supply hit the market hey there's a tifa psa a pristine 10 ending in seven hours so yeah. maybe we you know are we gonna have some videos on this hermosis coming yeah, up well, yeah and, oh yeah for sure uh, i'll now, be talking be about fair, this yeah. looking about supply again too always check ebay because there are more full yeah. arts concurrently on yeah. ebay right so yeah see how these prices shake out with the supply hitting it but you know opus 11 is still old and at these prices i feel like you're gonna have a pretty efficient market Very for the last old 1275 yeah 1275 and that's about you know that seems about right to me i could see that maybe going up to 1400 um you know it's and so also like right now is the time to buy these kinds of cards because we got from nightmares that's coming out and people want money to invest into that new set uh so it'll oh, be okay. yeah so right now, some of these people are trying to get new product that they can churn yeah that's typically what i what i've seen in the trend is that as a new set comes out you'll start to see more things on eBay and uh, certainly eBay and then TCG player. But from eBay, you see Euro right there. Like you get a lot, a lot from those regions there, right? Cause it's just so oh. huge over there. The Opus 11 is gonna be a really collectible, right? A very, very collectible set. Short printed, highly wanted, a lot of seven Final Fantasy seven stuff in there.